Hey everybody, how's it going? Um, as you can see, I got a lot of stuff. Spent a lot of money, although not as much as could have cost, I suppose. But I get to do it myself, so that's even better. Um, <laughs> just, yeah, calipers, uh, drums, brake pads, wheel cylinders, various lubes. Oh, yeah. Um, special tools. Some brake clean, some drum brake hardware, rotors, shoes, uh, brake lines. <laughs> Just pretty much everything. Um, and I plan on putting out something dealing with all of that, I suppose. I don't know how informative it will be. And there's a million things on the internet that tell you how to do all this stuff so I don't know that a dude trying to do it for the first time is the most beneficial information for people but we'll see um, and that will be coming up later on but I thought in the meantime I had made a made a video god I don't know last summer or something oh that's not mine I'm holding it for a friend um, yeah last summer I think um, about my tires I wanted to go over them just a little bit. It's a really short video, but I thought in the meantime, while I'm struggling with this fun project, that I would just upload that, kind of be a, I don't know, intermission between the glorious break job and, and the overview video. So, all right, I'm going to cut to that. It's about to get much nicer outside and my truck is working we'll see you there hey guys I want to make a quick video um, on my experiences I guess I'll call them as of late I went ahead and got 33s like I wanted to on my truck and I love them they're amazing but I was running into issues where you know looking at forums and stuff like will these actually fit on my 15 inch by seven and a half inch stock rims because they're 33 12 50s. but i was assured they would it's like all right let's do it and as far as you know clearance and stuff goes like that too i want to make sure that would work they do and here they are i love the way that they look i just i don't know it makes makes a stance of your you know typical ford f-series sorry if the sun's in your face Makes stance of your typical Ford F series look a little bit better. Because, you know, they only made like six billion of these things. But they look good. I do have some issues, though. I guess it should be made made clear. I did have to move the front bumper forward a little bit. I had to put some washers in here. Which you won't be able to see, but I had to put some washers in here to kind of kick this bit forward. About a quarter of an inch. Because it was, it was clipping the tires. And, let's see if you can see this. Yeah, there you go. Don't turn too sharply. Because they do rub. And it is embarrassing when you're at Casey's or some other gas station trying to make a sharp corner and you hear, doom, 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 doom. But, other than that, they do work. And they do look good. I went with hand cooks. They were, oh, I can't remember how much they were. Close to 200 bucks a piece. I probably could have got them cheaper, but that's all right. I got it done at Roadrunner Tire and Carney. My cousin owns the place. So, you know, if you live in rural Nebraska, need some tires, he will hook you up. But I'm pleased. I think, obviously, the next step is leveling everything because it's about I don't know three and a half inches taller in the back something like that so either that or I'll just you know scrap it all and get like a four four inch lift or something but at least I'm in the I'm getting closer to you know the official truck club now lifted big tires instead of driving a little baby truck with baby tires but yeah, I just kind of want to go with my experience. They are a little different to drive. You definitely feel more of the road, obviously because they're wider. 
some of you are probably going, yeah, no shit. But for those of you that don't know, that's that's what I got for you. But I will probably be doing some more stuff on this truck eventually as it goes along. And I will keep you posted. Wish light. No truck is complete without that in the bed. But it's been positive and hopefully I have these for a long time. Because they're expensive and I don't feel like replacing them. <laughs> but, alright, with that. I will check you guys later. Thanks again for watching and see you next time.